I don't know what someone's history is like with me when I sit in a room with them. I don't know if, you know, someone who I represent or someone who I look like or someone who I talk like robbed that person one day. This is the entrance to Rikers Island. I've been on this bridge many times, most times because I was incarcerated here. Across from this bridge, there's over 10,000 people who are locked up in jail. The problem with people who are locked up is they get comfortable, and I hated it. I couldn't stand it about inmates. So I used that to uh, push me to do something different. High Impact was the boot camp program that was on Rikers Island. It was a big turning point for me. Getting up early in the morning, folding my clothes, organizing, discipline. I'm gonna hold on to my discipline. I'm gonna pray harder than the in-house preacher. I'll read the prison law librarian. I'm gonna keep hospital corners on my bed to feel normal. I'm gonna go back to my cell, lock my gate, sit on a stack of books, and read. I just felt like this is the perfect time to learn how to read well. Going through a lot of books was something I really wanted to do while I was in prison, and I had the time to do it. It took one poem to change my life. One poem. That's it.